Today, we are going to be learning helping others. In this chapter, we will be learning people with special needs and caring for animals. Boost up your knowledge. Helping others makes us happy. Do you like helping a person who needs help? Do you help only your family members and friends? I help everyone. We have five sense organs. They are the eyes, ears, nose, tongue, skin. They help us to know about our surroundings. We have legs to walk, hands to do different activities, and brain to think. But there are some people who do not have all these senses. Such people have some special needs. Let us read more about those people. People with special needs. People have special needs if they are physically or mentally challenged and old and sick. Physically and mentally challenged people. When one or more body parts of a person do not work properly, we call that person physically challenged. People are physically challenged by birth or they become physically challenged later in life by an accident. Some people cannot see. Some people are deaf and dumb and cannot speak. Some people are lame and cannot walk properly. We should be kind to such people. They are our friends. We can read out books to the blind people. We can use sign language or hand movements to talk to deaf people. Did you know there are different degrees of blindness? In fact, only about 10 to 15 percent of the blind people cannot see anything. The Braille script for the blind. Braille is a system of reading and writing for the blind people. This system uses raised dots. Since the blind cannot read with their eyes, they feel and identify the letters by touching the raised dots with their fingers. The Braille script was devised by Lewis Braille. He was blind, but because he had the desire to read and write, he developed a special script with raised dots of six. We call it the Braille script. Old and sick. We should not call old people by their names. We should respect them. We should give company to them. We should do shopping for them. We should post their letters. We should offer our seat to them in buses or trains. The aged members of our families are called senior citizens. We can learn many things from them. We should not call anyone ill even if they have some disease. We should take care of them. We should give them medicines on time. We should sit by them so that they may not feel lonely. We should try to bring them good cheer. Orphans. Sometimes, some children lose their parents. They are known as orphans. You see some children roaming around on the streets alone. Some of them may be orphans who do not have parents. Such children also need special care. There are special homes called orphanages for such children. Their employees take care of the needs of the orphans. Most people look after children and give them food, clothing and shelter. They also educate them. We should help orphanages by donating clothes, books and even toys whenever you can. Caring for animals. Animals also need our care and love. We take care of our domestic animals and pets, but we do not bother about wild animals. Wild animals live in jungles. They are nature's gift to us, but man has been killing them for his joy. Many wild animals have already been extinct, and many more are dying out daily. Our government has taken some steps to save wild animals. Many national parks, and sanctuaries have been set up all over the country. People are not allowed to kill animals in these parks and sanctuaries. Look at the list of some national parks given below. National Park Dhudwa National Park in Uttar Pradesh Kanha National Park in Madhya Pradesh Hazari Bagh National Park in Jharkhand Corbett National Park in Uttarakhand Koyaladio National Park in Rajasthan 
Bandipur National Park in Karnataka, Kaziranga National Park in Assam, Madhumali National Park in Tamil Nadu. We should also take proper care of domestic animals. We should give them good food, clean water and safe shelter. We should take sick animals to a veterinary hospital. These veterinary doctors treat those sick animals. Did you know that peacock is the national bird of our country? Lord Krishna gave the peacock dignity and glory by wearing its feather in his crown. Alexander the Great liked the peacock and he took back Greece some peacocks and peahens from India. Here's a quick sum up. We should help the physically and mentally challenged. We should help the old and sick. We should take care of orphans. We should take care of animals. Here's the glossary of this chapter. Crippled. When a person is unable to walk, he is called crippled. Deprived is suffering a severe and damaging lack of basic material. Here's the mind map for you. People with special needs include orphans, old and sick, physically and mentally challenged, caring for animals. Physically and mentally challenged include the blind. For them, the Braille script was introduced. The crippled 